Hi you guys. It's Monday. Pay it forward Monday. Today I'm doing it a little different. I'm out in my car. I'm waiting on a to-go order and I'm at the new China King restaurant in Ardmore by Homeland. And um, I didn't even draw their name. I just thought I was in the mood for their um, sweet and sour chicken because it's fabulous. And then it's kind of been on my heart for a couple of days because um, they've had a couple of negative comments on Facebook about one of their cooks in the kitchen barefooted. And people going, ew, we're never going back, you know. Um, I'm not going to eat there anymore. And I thought, oh my gosh, that is so sad because I walked in there just now. I looked in the kitchen. Number one thing I'm going to say is I'm highly impressed because I do believe they're the only Chinese restaurant in town that allows the public to see into their kitchen. And their floor is spotless. Everybody had their shoes on today, which is amazing. Um, I googled it. I checked it out. Are they breaking any kind of law? Uh, no, they're not. What we have to realize is they're a small business. Family, small family business. And they work really hard and they make really good food for us. And I don't want something negative to hurt a small business. So I'm here to boost their business a little bit today and, um, and I'll continue to do so. I did try to talk to them. There was no one in there today that could speak English. They can take my order and they did that fine and it'll come out delicious and that's all I care about. Listen, I'm going to tell you, back in my day, I've worked in a lot of restaurants. I worked for one of the best chefs ever out on the West Coast. And he timed his food by a cigarette burning on top of the shelf above the food. Uh, if an ash fell in the food, well, I'm sorry, but at least he had the timing right on the food. Uh, yeah, we had to wear closed-toed shoes, uh, non-slip shoes. Because, honestly, the kitchens in most of these restaurants are so disgusting and the floor is so slippery that you need to. Um, I really don't care. I think it's just kind of comical, actually, that we're complaining about uh, somebody wear, uh, not wearing shoes on a spotless floor. I don't care if he's barefooted or wearing snow boots, just so he's not putting his feet in my food. Um, so that's how I feel about it. Um, I'm small business and I know bad gossip flies a lot faster than anything good you can do. And I, and I promise you, I bet if it offended you that he didn't have shoes on, if you told him put some shoes on to cook my food, I bet he would. Uh, I have thousands of customers in my store. One lady doesn't like dogs. Well, I have my little Yorkie that comes to work with me a lot. So when that one customer comes in, I pick up my dog. When you're in small business, you do whatever you can to keep return customers. Keep your customers happy. Customers are always right. And so we do our very best. So I just encourage everybody to come try out the new China King. Um, I think they're fabulous. It's uh, They have a lot of to-go orders, which I need to get in there because I think my food's probably ready. But um, let's not be negative. Um, there's enough negative out there. Let's support local business because if we destroy all of our small businesses in town, if we put them out of business by bad gossip, um, negative stuff, well, then where are we going to be? We're going to be left with the big dogs? I think that'd be a very sad day because I believe our small businesses give our town character, backbone, personality. So I'm going to continue to support my small local businesses on Mondays until no one else asked me to come I suppose but until then um, I've had a lot of fun um, amazing comments about thank you and thank yous you know because I have helped them get some new customers and that's what this is all about if one of my silly live videos only gets them um, one new customer it was worth it because this is free and it's Facebook and because I can so you guys have a blessed day it's Halloween so be safe out there watch for kiddos and enjoy all the candy I'm about to eat a phenomenal meal at New China King restaurant over by Homeland you guys if you haven't tried them come check them out doesn't matter if they can't speak English uh, they cook phenomenal food 
So let's just rock and roll this day and uh, I'll see you guys next Monday. Bye.